Vertical Centrifuge. The Environmental Solutions Vertical Centrifuge is a machine designed to reduce the operator's total fluids cost and limit waste disposal volumes. This is achieved by directly recovering the fluids from the cuttings and by recovering any weighted mud from the shaker screens, avoiding that it can be lost due to a failure of the shaker. The Environmental Solutions Vertical Centrifuge is designed to recover the liquid phase of the drilling fluid from drilled solids by exposing the latter to very high centrifugal acceleration forces which improve fluid separation from the drill cuttings. By further clarifying the costly liquid phase which can be returned to the active mud system. The working cycle of the VC is started by introducing the feed from the top of the machine through the charging hopper, immediately accelerated to the machine speed by the cone cap and flights and directed to the screen basket surface. Liquid solid separation starts immediately after contact with the screen basket surface. The flow rate over the screen is controlled by the speed differential between the cone and the basket and by the flights. Solids are discharged at the screen bottom and fall by gravity into the discharge area of the machine. Solids can then be collected by a hopper or other conveying system placed underneath the machine. Fluids flow through the screen in the launder area and are discharged through the affluent opening. There is always a possibility of changing the screen size to be suitable with the hole size and the formation type. The benefits of using the drying system are reducing environmental impact through the OBM discharge to the environment. The VC Cuttings drying system can reduce total discharge OOC below 5%, which is currently the discharge limit in many areas of the world. As a result of recovered OBM being returned to the mud system, the drilling fluid recovered provides a huge saving to the client through cost saving recovering mud and ultimately reducing the volume of waste generated by 40%, reducing the waste transportations and cutting skips used by 